So I'm hopeful that this is good. And if it is, I'm gonna buy multiples of these to have in different bags. Uh, and also I forgot to point out, it's made in France, yay! <laughs> Do 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 do. Welcome to Kiki's channel. Do do. Ding ding. Hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I'm back today with Inermez unboxing. Super exciting. Um, on the same day that I went to Louis Vuitton, which I did a vlog about. Oh, I think we have a friend. And no. Um, on the same day that I went to Louis Vuitton to do that vlog and um, buy a couple goodies, I also stopped by Hermes actually first. I vlog there, but I'm debating about whether I should actually make a video about the vlog because I'm not sure, are you allowed to post videos about like an Hermes shopping experience? I'm not sure and I don't really want to be blacklisted. So yeah, if you guys have any information about that, let me know. Um, but anyway, so here is my... Ta-da! Little bag of goodies that I got from Hermes. So this is, it's been quite a, well, I don't want to call it a journey, but it's been a while since I've shopped at Hermes. I think almost, almost one year, I think. Not quite. Um, because I was just taking a little bit of a break from it. Sometimes it's, even though it's shopping, it, it can be a little bit in, intense, I think, at Hermes. It's just its own world. I mean, if you know, you know what I'm trying to say. Um, and actually my sales associate, who is my second associate, kind of, I mean, when I first shopped at Hermes, um, starting, I think 2014 or 2015, I didn't have a sales associate just because I just would buy one or two things and it, I would just be a walk in. I didn't have any intention at that time to really start a so-called journey. Um, who knows? Sorry, he was trying to eat my, this is why, even though I bought these mics, um, I don't often use them if he's in the room or because he just, I'm so afraid he's gonna swallow it and then choke. You silly baddie, baddie. Um, where was I? Oh yes, yeah, so this is actually my um, third SA, official SA, I guess before the walk-ins, I don't remember who they were when I did my walk-in just uh, purchases. So my essay who had been the one to get me my Birkin and a few other things uh, had sadly left. So, oh gosh, oh dear. Had sadly left. And so I'm on to a new one. Uh, she seems really nice. I've shared my wish with her and she seems to have written it down. You know, you never know if they actually put it into their iPad and into the system or not, but I am hopeful. Uh, but anyway, let's just get straight to the unboxing. Oh my gosh, my essay was so sweet to include a magazine. I believe this is the autumn winter one of the scarves as well as a little scarf booklet. That's so sweet of her. I love collecting these. I wasn't sure what this was and at first I thought it was the receipt because they had um, run out of the regular uh, envelopes or receipt holders but it turns out it was the lipstick box. I believe that's another beautiful booklet of um, scarves that my essay kindly included. And here is the receipt. Okay, so first thing out of the bag is, at first I thought this was the receipt, but I think I am incorrect. As you know, sometimes, not sometimes, often they're running out of all their, um, hmm, what is this? Oh, this is the box, I think. The box for the lip enhancer. That's interesting. Um, so I guess that kind of reveals the first item that I got. Oh, they wrapped it up so nicely for me. So this is what that is. I'm sure by the size and shape of the box, you know, 
It is a lippy a lip product. Now I have a few of them already and I do like them quite a bit. They are extremely pricey for what they are, but at the same time, when you compare them to Chanel or like Tom Ford, the prices, the packaging, and just the fact that it comes with this beautiful, he wants to be part of this. Beautiful packaging. They took it out of the case so that they put it in the box for me, which is usually, I guess, you could do. You do not do that. It's just, it's so beautiful that it has its own dust bag. You don't face this way, face the camera, face the camera. And here it is. I got their um, Rose Tan Lip Balm because I have some of their other lip products. Sorry, I'm just gonna lean back. Um, but for me, especially in the last year or two, or maybe I should have known this about myself better before, I prefer to use more, um, satiny or even shiny finish lip products just because my lips are very dry. I don't know if you guys have the same problem. It might be because I live in Canada. It's really dry here, especially in the winter. And I find that my lips are flaky and I really don't like that matte lip flaky kind of look. It just doesn't work for me. Um, so here we go. It's kind of like a dusty rose, which is my, kind of my thing. And it's such a oh, magnet, magnetized. It's so beautiful. Here you see the top. Here's the bottom. I just love their lip products. They are a work of art. They're really beautiful. Pricey, yes, but I think I like the fact that they do offer refills. So there is that. Um, and they're just so nice to pull out of your purse. And I feel like it's a moment that you can enjoy. Like, you know, it's the small things in life. And even when you're at home and you're taking care of the kids, running after the bunny, the dog, you can still kind of, you know, have that moment to yourself. Well, can I? Can I have the moment to myself? Never. Never. <laughs> okay. All right, the second item that I got, and she wrapped this separately, which is amazing. I love that she did that. Just because, you know, since COVID, the packaging has been such a hit and miss. They've been missing this and that. I've bought things and had no boxes. I've bought things and had no bags. Can you believe it? This time there was no tissue paper. There's always something missing, and I get it, the supply chain, and even though I'm kind of iffy, I wonder. I think rather than supply chain, what I really think is that with the price increases across the board, people who were originally purchasing at other luxury houses have decided to, to switch to Hermes perhaps. And so they've just had more sale volume and haven't been able as of yet to reach the demand. That's my theory. I don't know what you guys think. Um, let me know in the comments below, but that's my, my, my uh, conspiracy theory inside this bag is i think and this is um i have to give a shout out to my van cleef and arpel sales associate she is such a sweetie we're like or we're, i don't want to say friends but friends kind of right every time i go there oh my god goodness sorry sorry technical difficulties he was being a bit of a poop and then puff almost knocked down my whole setup um where was I? So my Van Cleef and our pal sales associate is such a sweetie. We're pretty good friends, I would say. And I know some people are like, you can't be friends with sales associates, blah, blah, blah. But, you know, I think you can in a way. Um, but anyway, long story short, she recommended this because we're both dog lovers. She has also a small dog. And she said that this is a great item to get from Hermes. And so I got one too. And I mean, the price is expensive. Don't get me wrong. But um, in the world of Hermes, and actually in the world of expensive dog products, it wasn't that bad. I mean, his brushes also cost me similar prices, which is, it is what it is. What does he use? He uses this brand like Chris Christensen Hammondson. Anyway, he's quite a famous brand for, for dog products. And yeah, I mean, I think he's worth it. So super happy to get this. Let's test it out. Oh, come here. Oh, you don't know what's about to happen to you. You don't even know. You don't even know. That's what you get for eating things. Eating mics and sponges. Oh, look at that hair flying. I don't know if the camera's going to catch it. But whoa. Oh my gosh. This is why I have allergies. 
Oh my god. I think with all the lighting, it, I can really see it well. Well, mommy's gonna have to roll over her clothes again, but who am I kidding? I probably won't. Ah. That's just not the kind of knife we need. Seems pretty good. So why I really like this brush, and I mean Hermes is an equestrian br uh, brand, is because it has these, see at the end of each pin, it's rounded so it doesn't hurt them. So when you go like this, it's not irritating, it feels fine. Which is great because if anyone knows dogs and they know small dogs, especially Pomeranians, they are they are divas. They are really, really sensitive and very, very difficult to groom. As um, when I went to a pet expo with him, that's what the, one of the groomers told me. And I believe it because I've had a, my previous dog, my angel Teddy, was the same way. Hated all types of grooming. Don't touch him with a brush. He will just like, Yer. So... I'm hopeful that this is good, and if it is, I'm going to buy multiples of these to have in different bags. Uh, and also, I forgot to point out, it's made in France. Yay! <laughs> Not that important, but kind of, you know, for this price. Oh, handsome boy now. Handsome. Okay, so I think I'm going to end this video here with these two items and then I'm going to open my last item in another video just because I think I hear my daughter um, getting a little bit unsettled downstairs, so I'm going to have to go grab her. I had set up um, an educational video, basically, yeah, iPad for her uh, to watch and I think, I think we're reaching the limit, so I'm going to have to come run back up and film this in a minute, but what did you guys think about my two items, lip balm and... Ooh! Pet brush, highly recommend it if you're also a pet owner and pet lover. I wonder if you could use it for, okay, I'm not gonna, on my own hair now, but I think, I wonder if you could. Well, I guess you could, I, mean, I don't wonder. Oh my gosh, for everywhere. Um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. I'll be back again, of course, with my third item unboxing, and I'll see you guys next time. Please leave a comment or suggestions for new videos on the bottom. And I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye, Janet. Ding ding. Do 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 do. Thanks for watching. Come again. Bye bye.